if I didn't have Oregon treatment support, I think that would be probably left, left behind. I think that Oregon Train Megamix makes a big difference, not just for me, but for other women who are behind me and who, you know, probably ahead of me. There's a trade for everybody, you know, and uh, there's a job for every woman in every trade. This is a really good opportunity and it opens up a lot of doors career-wise. Like, and nobody's gonna push you but yourself. I had graduated in 2016, and since that time to now has been a tremendous journey for me because I had the opportunity to learn the trades, but also to be self-sufficient, to have an opportunity to get a career in the trades, like you want to be an electrician, you want to be a welder, you want to be a carpenter. I think that um, because, you know, the criminal history is not very easy because you have barriers that sometimes they're not well understand, especially when you have that criminal background, it's very difficult to get a position you know, that you are qualified for. I appreciate Oregon Tradeswomen's help in uh, bringing individuals into our program that may not have the opportunity to get to see our program or get to see what we do. Another thing that Oregon Tradeswomen has been excellent about is their support with their graduates. Um, there's been many times where we've had uh, women that have had struggles and I've reached out with Kelly and other people at Oregon Tradeswomen, and together we've been able to offer help and to get people back on track if you know something's happened. And uh, that kind of support is what we need to help people to be successful and to be able to finish our program. Uh, counselors have helped me to uh, to rebuild my credit, and I was able to get a home loan. And uh, that, you know now I have a you know I have a home and I'm a homeowner. So that's one of the positive and amazing things that I'm so proud of to talk about this because um, that's how I can become self-sufficient in all these things to uh, this organization. I've learned a lot from Oregon Tradeswomen in the three years that I've been a director. In our trade, a lot of the things that you'll see that we teach, you can learn on YouTube and other things, but what I've learned from Oregon Tradeswomen is that uh, it's about confidence. You can go and learn things online but what you can't learn online is how to be confident. And uh, Oregon Tradeswomen taught us how important it is for our apprentices to have that confidence to be able to go out in the field and be successful. And that's one of the reasons that I'm here also to mentor other women because sometimes they need that courage. They can do whatever they, can, they, they want because they have the ability, they have the strength. You know, they need to be encouraged, they need to be supported, and that's why we need to mentor, mentor and coach. With a deficit of 87,000 trades workers in the state of Oregon and a wait list of over 1,000 in Oregon tradeswomen, we need to come together to help expand opportunities. In every place that Oregon tradeswomen has had a class, we've taken everybody that we could from those programs. And if there was more opportunity and more places that Oregon tradeswomen can operate, we'd have a lot more women we'd be able to bring in in those areas as well. I'm from one of the Oregon reservations, Warm Springs, and I saw a Facebook flyer saying that they were gonna be in Redmond, and I wanted to jump on that because, you know, they don't really come out here very often, and I wanna be one of the people who are, you know, lucky enough to be a part of it. You know, there's not very many women in the construction industry, and I kinda of wanna be a part of the percentage that's changing it. I mean, the great thing about the trade that people don't realize is the wealth and the opportunity to earn for everybody is so great that that's generational. It's something that you can pass on to your kids and their grandkids and the opportunity to be able to do that is amazing and it should be there for everybody, not just men. I'm able to earn, you know, that income to maintain myself, you know, my home, you know, and, help my, you know, my siblings and, and so on. So I think that that's, that's the greatest, you know, the greatest thing that I can, can, I can say. Please generously donate to Oregon Tradeswomen. Uh, the opportunities that it will create for women and, and the opportunities for their families and their families' families are incredible. They can have a dream. 
they can have hope to own a home. They can have the opportunity to have a well-paying job. Anything that you can do to help uh, would be amazing industry-wide.